Hey, what's up everybody? It's Mark Benedetto here and welcome to another home tour. Today, we are in one of tradition's finest gated communities, the Estates. Located just west of I-95 in Port St. Lucie, Florida, we'll be viewing this beautiful contemporary style home built by the Toll Brothers in 2006. This home features all block concrete, completely impact windows, and your nice tile roofing. It features a three car garage, a pool jacuzzi area in the back, four beds, four baths, 2,800 square feet of interior living room, and is on the market for $745,000. Without further ado, let's begin. As we make our way towards the entrance, you'll notice these beautiful pavers leading up to the front door. This allows maximum parking room for your guest family um, when you have company over uh, at parties. And upon entry to the door, we're gonna be greeted by these nice high arches and these half concrete pillars here that really give it a grand kind of feeling entering the home. So come on in. Okay. Upon entry to the home, we have our nice big arches leading the way in with our high 18 foot ceilings. Moving along, we have our tile floors throughout the entire entrance and living room kitchen area with our two massive concrete pillars here that give the home more of a grand luxury kind of feel. Moving into the living room, we have our vaulted ceilings, again, 18 feet tall, with a beautiful view of your pool area and preserve in the back. Coming around this way, we'll head into the first room this way. Walking into the first bedroom, we'll notice the transition from the tile to the hardwood floors, give it a very homey kind of feel, comfort. We have our 18 foot ceilings again in here with our nice big window, allowing a lot of natural sunlight to come in. And behind you, we have our complete cabinetry closet area, which provides maximum amount of space. Coming back this way, we'll go to our first bathroom. Comes with a full walk-in shower with your tile all the way to the ceiling, your water closet, and your stone vanity here. Now this way, we're gonna jump right into the primary bedroom. There's a huge spacious area with the double doors greeting you in. The rooms in this house are gonna be all hardwood floors and you have a nice exit out this way to your pool area, your beautiful scenery, your preserve area, very private, very spacious, vaulted ceilings. We have his and her closets right here. Again, all custom cabinetry. The spaces are endless in this house. Coming into the primary bath, you'll have your dual sinks on opposite sides. Again, double pantries here for extra storage. Your Whirlpool tub to sit here your nice shades and window to allow in some of that nice natural sunlight as you soak after having a nice long day at the office or just enjoying the sun, you know? So that's a tough day as well too at the beach all day. And your nice walk-in shower as well too um, that you can access very easily. Exiting the primary bedroom, we'll go to our dining area next. This is a huge area as well with your high vaulted ceilings, 18 foot. This is a nice dedicated area to your dining experience. And this room really gives kind of a nobility kind of feel to it. We'll move into the second half of the house. Down this corridor, we have an extra storage room right here. And here we'll see our third bedroom and this would be considered an end suite because this one is attached with your bathroom right in there. Again, the hardwood floors in these rooms and in your bathroom, you have again, your tub, shower, water closet, and your nice stone vanity in here. We'll head to our pantry room next, which is just on the other side of this. 
You have your dedicated room to your pantry and your wash, a sink with running water, which comes in handy, you know, when working with things of this matter. And then your nice cabinets up here for your extra storage and closet space as well. Leaving the pantry room, we'll have the garage door here. Coming up, we'll be greeted by the scullery. And this is in between the dining room and kitchen. This is a nice area to keep your extra kitchen utensils, dishes. Also, it gives you that nice extra counter space that you need as well too, um, from your dining table to your kitchen. Also allows for a nice setting. So you can keep your spirits here, coffee makers, tea. So moving into the kitchen area, we have our double ovens here embedded into the cabinets. Stainless steel appliances throughout the kitchen, your fridge here, and right behind the fridge is our nice prep area where we can now move vegetables and goods from the fridge, prepare them here. No mess, everything stays here. You're not moving back and forth with stuff. And now you can serve your guests this way along this nice extended granite bar area here. We'll take a look at our embedded stove here as well too. This is a gas range, which is super luxurious in um, this kind of setting, especially in Florida. And then this is also built into the cabinets as well too. And you'll notice between these dark wood cabinets and these light tile floors really adds a nice contrast to the house, bringing in different colors and textures. And it just kind of mixes it up with that two-tone feel. So out of the kitchen, we'll head to our breakfast area here where we have a nice, beautiful windows here of our outside area, our pool, jacuzzi, our nice preserve back this way. And you do get a little waterfront view from the lake on the side here. So again, some great views this home has to offer. Moving from the breakfast area, we'll head to our fourth and final bedroom. If you've been paying attention, these bedrooms have common themes in them. They all have the wooden floors, closets, with the extra storage spots in there. And then additional pantry space and our fourth and final bathroom, again, with the same um, theme without the bathrooms. We have our stone vanity, our water closet, and walk-in tile shower. Now we're gonna head outside. Here, this will bring us out to an additional 2,000 square feet of additional living space. We have our huge screened in area, our nice little yard here, fenced in, great for animals. Coming down, we have our heated pool and jacuzzi area, our four fans to keep a nice cool breeze out here during those hot days and a nice little entertainment center dining area here, followed with your grill and extra storage down this way. You'll also notice the brick pavers here as well too. That was as the same in the driveway, which gives a nice flow to the house. And you'll notice our four glass sliding doors here that can slide all the way open to bring the outside and inside together. Allows for big parties, entertainments, it's perfect for those cool times of the years, those winter months, when you can really open up these doors and join the two rooms together. And with your nice screened in back patio here, you'll be able to keep out all those uh, pesky insects and wildlife that may try to crash your party. A really nice feature to this home. All right, and this will bring us back into the living room, bringing this tour full circle. That's it for the tour today. I'd like to thank you for joining me on it. As always, more information about the property will be listed in the description below. If you like this video, please leave a comment or a like. I look forward to touching base with all of you. And if you would like your own private tour of this wonderful home, I'd be happy to give that to you as well. So as always, I hope you have a wonderful day and I'll see you soon. Ciao.